the Wainami Church past Sunday, Pastor Harry. We have uh, our Mosby Northwest District uh, Director, Pastor Asitore, is here with us. They will be officiating the baptism this morning. And also we will have to uh, co-lead the baptism at the main talk for uh, Heaven knows that precious souls will be giving their lives into the water of baptism and that is why this program, our program this morning is sanctified. And heaven is with us, the angels are here with us. They know that the little elementary students, they know that they can bear the sun, that is why God gave us a good weather. For us to all enjoy together and we will celebrate. I want to preach it. We have heard a lot of messages through our team, in our team, throughout our school evangelism, our festival of praise, one week festival of praise, and our team is entitled, what? Pray, praise and what? Pray, praise and proclaim. We have had wonderful messages through the songs throughout this week. And so this is the time that we all come here to witness the baptism and I won't be preaching. But there's one thing that I will do, and I will do the Bible reading for us. About the five students, about is a, is a promise. About is a promise. It is an expression of your faith that you are publicly showing. I will read to you. After the reading of each of those baptismal vow, you will respond to me. And your response is basically your vow or your promise, and you must keep that promise. So after my reading, by responding, you will say yes. All right? All right, when you say yes, loud enough, you must be able to say loud enough so that even the students at the back must be able to also hear you. All right, number one. Do you accept Jesus Christ as your personal Savior and Lord? And do you desire to live your life in a saving relationship with Him? That is not loud enough. Let me read again. Alright? That's okay, don't be nervous. Keep calm. This is your day. Let me read it again. Do you accept Jesus Christ as your personal Savior and Lord? And do you desire to live your life in a saving relationship with Him? Thank you. That sounds better. Number two. Do you accept the teachings of the Bible as expressed in the statement of the fundamental beliefs of the Seventh-day Adventist Church? And do you pledge by God's grace to live your life in harmony with these teachings? Very good. Finally. Do you desire to be baptized as a public expression of your belief in Jesus Christ and to be accepted into the fellowship of the Seventh-day Adventist Church and to support the church and its mission as a faithful steward by your personal influence through tithes, offerings and a life of service? Very good. Thank you. You may take a seat. Yes. Thank you. Now I would like to call up on the teachers for the special item. The teachers, please come up to the stage and render on behalf of all of us for the special item. Thank you, teachers. Those teachers that we have shown the retreat team song, the last time we went for the retreat, the camera can be seen. You don't, don't worry about how we sing, we are your teachers. Don't worry, whether we sing how
Amun Yesli or we don't sing Amun Yesli, that's not, uh, that's not an issue. Just listen to the message you saw. We are here to praise God. Okay, at least the teachers must sing to the students. Not only teaching you, but we must also sing.